at two all time, 740. You're leading it there after the rabbit drops off. You're not normally doing that. So what was the mentality of going right to the lead after the rabbit's gone? Um, so my boy told me just sit wherever, sit behind the, the rabbit all the time and uh, try to help those guys like my old teammates and uh, those Nike guys so that uh, knock out your qualifier for NCAA. So my call to come here today to just run fast as I can to break school record and uh, knock out my qualifier for NCAA for 3K. What was it like mixing up with all the pros, you know, normally racing all these college kids? Yeah, it's, it's fun, you know, like last week I, I think I ran a 5K, so, and I was still recovering from that, so I think I'm getting myself ready for end season towards the summer. Are you happy with this 740? Or? Oh yeah, that, that was my goal, so my PR was like 747, that was my freshman year, and I was like, you know, I gotta go here, get another PR, and maybe next year I'm gonna go for Maybe a collegiate record if I get time. So is it battling Eric Jenkins again on the back stretch there? Uh, yeah, you know, I, t I think I make a mistake leading hold out through it. Eric got something left a little bit, and I'm like, you know, Eric is he's a, he's a good guy and he has a good kick. And just, he saw him, I, I didn't have any, anything left, but I'm like, you know, if I got it, just go for the time and knock out my qualifier. Right. Normally when you go for those times though, you just sort of sit towards the back, let the pace go a little bit. This one you were, you were leading, why, you know, I think you probably would have gotten time for NCAAs no matter how you played it, why did you decide to go from the front? Yeah, I think I always like to sit back, but this one, I think no one tried to take a lead, so after the pedal dropped out, I was trying to wait someone to come, but no one came in. And I was like, it's fine, so if no one came in, my video was like, keep going. It's, keep grinding and I'm like, okay, so I'm going to do that. Yeah. You made a 13.35 5K last week. Did you feel that in the legs at all when you were in this 3K? Uh, not really. That, I took it easy. That 5K was easy. I think I raced the last 600. That was it. And uh, I'm just getting that traveling, you know, in a long, long, long way from what I've been to here. Do you plan on trying to maybe rest for an FPSF to try to... Uh, we don't know yet. You know, as I say, always I go day by day. So whatever coach asks me to do, I'll do it properly. Go up there, support my teammates, or just run one event. Yeah, you have uh, NCAA qualifying time, the mile, 3K, 5K. You get asked this question a lot. Is this coach going to ask you to triple? Oh, uh, for now we just leave it open. So we're trying to get as many as high as score for the team. So if we need points, I, I probably do whatever coach ask me. If he does ask you, do you think you will win all three? I think I think I'm coming from doing it. So let's just go there, have fun, and. The rest of the last couple of laps. Were you trying to get the collegiate record today, just the PR? What was the goal? Uh, the goal for they just come here to just knock out the qualifier. So I wasn't even going for the um, for the collegiate record. My goal is to come here, try to break the school record, and um, knock out the qualifier. Is it nice to be able to run this big fast time though? Because usually a lot of your races are very tactical. You're not yeah. always going for PR. I, I really like like a big race like this, but once in a while I just get time to you know run with a big, big race like this one. And I'm looking forward to in the future from now. All right, nice race. Thanks.